Tristan on the track. Yo, what up, Longheads? It's your boy, El Moreno! Yeah, from the Longheads. And man, I'm pumped to be back. It's been a minute since I've done a video, so it's good to see your face. Hope you're pumped to see my face, and more importantly, my hair, motherfucker! <laughs> anyway, man, we got a great one lined up, especially for the weekend and especially for summer coming in. As you can see, I got my trusty long hairs lid for locks on. And yes, gentlemen, that's exactly what we're going to go over today. How to wear your hair with the hat. Any of you guys have been following us for a while may remember back in August, we did a post called 10 ways to wear your hair with a hat. It was a straight photo post and it just had 10 different styles uh, that you could use to wear your hair with a hat. We had a lot of questions on some of those styles. How the hell do I do it? So we thought we'd take those and make it into this video. So we're gonna run through six unique styles that you can use this weekend with your long hair and your hat and feel sweet about it. Number one, the lefty. First and foremost, you're gonna need your trusty hair ties for guys, all right? I got the Outdoorsman's here. Happen to be one of my favorite collections, especially this orange. Really stands out when it's in my mane, all right? So I like to just go ahead and just put it on the wrist while I do this. Uh, for the lefty, you can pull it off with a hat on. So if you're wearing your hair down and you have a hat on, you could uh, get this going right with the hat on. Don't even need to take it off. Okay, so you're going to grab all your hair. Make sure you get it all. And you're going to yank it on over to the left side. Yeah, pull it over to the left, you know. Don't be yanking your hair out, shit, but just get it on over there, all right? So what I'm, most times if I'm going to do a low ball or a pull over, it's going to be like kind of at the base right here. We want to focus that energy over here, just behind the ear. All right, so I just go ahead and hold it. Got it right where I want it. I'm going to just go ahead and wrap it on up twice there, mate. See that speed wrap, dog, speed wrap. Okay, what I like to do is just pull the hair a little bit too to really kind of clench down the hair tie. And uh, look at it, that's it. Now I'm off to the left. I'm looking good, I'm feeling good. This one's good for summer, man, when it's really hot and you're just kind of chilling. Not very good if you're like super active, if you're running or something, you know, this thing's gonna fall out for sure. But it keeps the hair off your neck and just kind of moves it on over to the side. And plus it's a, it's a unique little look, you know, not many people rock it like this. So that is the lefty. Slip that one right into the holster, all right? Coming in at number two, we got the drape. What the goal is, is we want to drape our hair over our ears and really just kind of have it just rocking straight down, covering the ears, all right? So what I like to do, just kind of quickly, is just kind of brush my hair with my hands. I mean, if you're at a bar or something and you want to do this, like this is all you need is your hands. You can get your hair looking good. You can just, you know, drape it down right there with the hands. Uh, I'm using a snapback for this example. The Commander, to be exact. You can find that in the men's aisle. Uh, but, uh, you know, I, I might take the take it off or loosen it to one notch than what I would normally wear for this style in particular because I'm going to bring it down and go over my ear. So you see when you put a hat on, it starts kind of sucking the hair up under your ears. So when you start getting it on, just go ahead and pull your ears down. Then you want to grab right under above your ears and just kind of slide it on. Now it's sitting directly over my ears. It's holding my ears down and it's just covering, all the hair is covering my ears. Now it's definitely a cool look. This one, the drape is style over comfort for sure. Uh, and I say that because this is all coming down and if you gotta go eat or you're, it's a little windy or, or you know, you're moving fast. I mean, this is coming up into your face. It, it can get annoying, but it does look super sick. So really kind of depends what you're going for. This is a good one if you're trying to get that, uh, really showing off your mane with the hat on. The drape. 
coming in at number three. These are in no particular order, by the way, like as best or worst. They're just, I'm just numbering them. So number three is the good old Prairie Dog. Now this happens to be one of my favorites. It's great if you're gonna be working, moving a lot, uh, let's say beach volleyball, you know, you're just working on the yard, you're working on your truck, whatever. This one is great for that. Basically what a prairie dog is, is it sits right outside the hole of a snapback. So you gotta have a snapback for this one, sorry for you fitted hat lovers, but uh, if you wanna pull this one off, you have to have a snapback. So what we're gonna do, step one, just get your hair in a high ball. Now what's nice is you don't need to really worry about what's happening up here. Like this kid just looks sloppy as hell up here because it's gonna be covered with the hat, you know? The big thing is you just wanna get all your hair back and get a nice solid high ball. So I'll go ahead, do my standard high ball move. Twist her on up there, get it in. All right, there we go, feeling good. All right, cool. See, I don't really care about what's happening up here. So now, we're taking the hat, okay? Step two of this is now feeding the highball through that hole in your snapback. Just hold it up there, adjust, and you're good. You can make any adjustments to the hat, but as you can see, all the hair completely off my neck and I'm feeling good. And this thing up here is not going anywhere. So it's really good for being active uh, and just taking it all off your hair. It's a super hot day, this is the way to do it. Number four, the willy. First things first, the goal is we wanna separate both of our hair. What we're gonna do is put two ties in. Now if you have shorter hair, this one's gonna be a little bit tougher. Uh, but, you know, let's give it a try still. I'm gonna go focus on my right side. I got all this hair over here, all right? Now I got one hair tie on the side here. I'm just gonna go ahead and tie this thing up, mate. Basically, it's just two men's tails on the sides. And I usually can do like a four wrapper on this and I'll slide it down a little bit. All right, I got that one. Now I got another one on my other hand here. Now it looks kind of goofy if you rock it from the front, which we're not gonna do. Um, just gonna be there for this moment. This is a little awkward doing the left side, but you get some reps at it, you'll figure it out. Little trick with hair ties. You know, you could twist this like this to get more strength out of, or more tightness out of it. So instead of trying to wrap it five times, I could literally just twist the hair tie around and then wrap it twice and it's still got a good wrap. All right, there we go, that's the Willy. I mean, really properly, we probably wanna have two braids to really rock it, how Willy does. But uh, you know, you could rock it in the front. I think it looks a little goofy, but, so if, when I do it, I'll have it in the back. And uh, you know, you just got your, your little things hanging off there. Uh, yeah, I don't really know exactly what this is good for, so you have to figure that one out yourself. <laughs> Number five. Uh, this is pretty much the standard go-to. You're gonna do this all the time. Most guys I see in the street have a rock in this, and that's just called the tuck. Really, it's a simple, it's the fastest one, and it's really the go-to. You put your hat on, you just tuck right behind the ears there. And I think it's the most natural Feels probably the most comfortable. What's great is the ears hold the hair back and the hat, the hat holds everything up here just out of your way and everything. It does get a little warm though, I'm gonna say that. So it's not good if it's a super hot day or if you're trying to go do something active. Uh, you know, you're gonna be getting some heat on the neck, definitely. But this is by far the standard go-to easiest style to rock and it looks good it's always gonna look good and another great thing about this style is it doesn't matter if your hair is as long as mine longer than mine or shorter this one works always so you could have hair that's right barely at your shoulders and you know you're gonna probably want to go with the tuck all right that's the tuck number six last 
but not least, by far the most asked about style from that blog post, 10 ways to wear your hair with a hat. This one is called the undercover. So basically what we're gonna do here is we're just gonna try to hide our long hair into the hat, okay? Now, it's really hard, especially if you have really long hair, because you're gonna have stuff kind of flopping out, but that's what kind of makes this a cool look. Uh, and it is actually pretty functional too, because the hat gets so tight, because there's so much pressure in there, that it really holds your hair pretty damn well. So what you wanna do to start off, to pull the undercover off, is you're gonna go grab it all, okay? You're gonna bring it up to the top of your head, like so, and just hold it up here. And you can see I'm trying to just kind of get it all up in here. And this one is not easy, folks. It might even take me twice to try to get it right. But you don't really want to try worry about making it tight. You just want to get everything kind of bundled up here. All right? Oh, applying pressure with your left hand, you're going to bring your hat around with the right, and you're going to start with the back, okay? So this is the tricky part, because you gotta try to get it in and slide your hand out at the same time. So I'm holding it, and you can see I'm already getting stuff coming out the sides and stuff. Okay, boom, there we go. I kinda got a lot of it in there now. Now see, like I said, this is just part of the look. It looks kinda weird as you're going, but you start pulling the hat down. Yes, boom, okay. Then you can kinda work it around, tighten some things up on the sides, clean your ears up if you need to. You know, I got some little danglers back here, but there we go. I have all my hair now tucked inside of my hat and I'm rolling undercover, son. So let's see, check it out on the side, the back. I feel like I got some, some looseness here so I could maybe try to even tuck that under a little bit more if I want. You gotta do this all the way around. Shove it in there if you feel like it's, uh, you know, not not fully tightened in. But uh, this is seemed to be a, fa a favorite on the blog. Let's see, I might still got some little loose guys there. There we go. I think we're looking pretty undercover now. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, son. So this one's cool. This is a, another good one to, uh, you know, if you, if you need to move around a lot, you just want to get everything out of your face. You really want to feel the breeze through your neck. Um, this one's great. And it, it's, it's cool. And it, uh, it will make people think that you might have cut your hair because it is all tied in there. Um, but, you know, if you have his hair as long as mine and it's like popping out of the back of your, uh, your snapback and such, they're going to know. But it's all good. That's it for how to wear your hair with a hat. There's probably a lot of other styles that I would love to see if you guys could just come up with. Drop some ideas in the comments. Give us some funny names, whatever you want. And uh, you know, maybe we'll do another photo post of trying some, some new styles. 10 ways to wear your hair with a hat part two. Uh, that could be fun in the future. But would love to get ideas from you guys. And you can always submit them to the blog, you can email us, or you can put stuff right in the comments right here, right here on YouTube. I wanna hook you up. You've seen the whole time I've been rocking this hat right here. This is called The Commander and you can find it in the men's aisle. We have three other styles of hats that you're gonna find there. The Spy, we have the Admiral, and we have the Captain. And for you guys, while supplies last, 15% off using coupon code LIDS. <laughs> so just use the coupon code LIDS, you get 15% off, get yourself hooked up with a nice lid for lock. Until next time, gentlemen, it was a pleasure. I hope you take these six ways to wear your hair with a hat into the weekend, into the summer, and rock them. Can't wait to hear from you, and we'll see you around.